So one of the things, Boozer, like, that always fascinate me with being, like, you know, with the N1 mixtape world and music, and we'll get into the N1 mixtape question in a minute, but the sound, I always call it the soundtrack of players, right? Mm. You know, um, I got a chance to interview Isaiah Thomas, the great Zeke, once, and I asked him, I said, yo, man, like, what was you listening to, like, when you was, and I was like, he was like, man, you know what we came out to? Houdini, the freaks come out at night. Mm. He said, <laughs> we got wild at nighttime. And I was like, he was like, me, Bill Lampin, we used to, that song used to pump us up. And like, I think now, kids, we know what LeBron is listening to with Future and like Lil Baby and Lil Dirt. But like, what was you listening to when like, when you came in, like some of them songs that you had you like, oh yeah, I'm about to go out here and destroy it on the night. Yeah, man, I, I listened to a lot of Kiss growing up. Mm. Uh, oh. A lot of kids, <laughs> yeah, a lot of Big, okay. a lot of Pac, mm -hmm. uh, Jay, those are like my That's name. why he was dominating like those that. Are, those are my, yeah, that's why I got like hype, that. yeah. <laughs> you want to get, like, even X, I used to bump DMX too, because mm. it would get me like, let's go to war, kind of, kind of mentality. You, know, you want to bump something that's going to be your, like, who you're going to be on the court. Like, who I am off the court and mm. who I step into, my alter ego on the court was two different people. Mm. So I needed something to listen to that would get me into my alter ego. DraftKings presents Starting Five, live from the compound. 